Just as every human being is unique, so too is every person born with Angelman Syndrome. It was once believed that to have Angelman Syndrome, you had to have blue eyes and blonde hair. But you might find that some also have dark hair, brown eyes, and the skin can come in olive. Jader is an Aquarius and curious. Billy was born in the year of the rooster and has a keen sense of pride. Mendy is Jewish and Tara is English. Charlotte has strabismus. Lucy has wider spacing in her teeth, but Hannah doesn't have either of these. Mitch rocks some collector's edition Air Jordans, although he cannot walk confidently. Jacob, on the other hand, doesn't sit still. However, you might find that balance is not a natural strength in anyone with Angelman syndrome, and a wide gait is common, though with intensive therapy, many can walk independently. Katie swings on a swing set. Alara swings from a tree. Caitlin is much happier watching. Chandra is shy, and Joel loves company. Jake and Jed use sign language while others prefer a pod or an iPad. Theo and Sophie are brother and sister, both born with Angelman syndrome. Alex and Hannah are also brother and sister. Alex can trace his name, Hannah cannot. When Harley was young, he wouldn't sleep. Now he rests, but like an angel. Yes, happiness is a prominent feature, but so are tantrums and sadness. Although you usually find it's nothing a hug cannot fix. What is fascinating fascinates. Water, crinkling textures, movement, touching, chewing, food. Angelman syndrome is a rare disorder characterised by global developmental delays, meaning some may miss the usual milestones like breastfeeding, sitting up and holding a spoon. And yes, seizures are common, sometimes big, sometimes small. Some outgrow them, some do not. In fact, the only thing all these individuals have in common is an error caused by one single gene in chromosome 15 which is why at birth, so many go undiagnosed, and it may take weeks, months, or years even, before parents realize something unusual, which is why we suggest, if you notice something extra unique about your child, like these parents did, then you visit your local pediatrician. But remember, Angelman syndrome is a rare condition, which makes it easy to slip by sometimes. And never forget, there's a community here with knowledge and support, if ever you need it. Go to www.cureangelman.org.au or visit your local paediatrician for more information.